buddies, welcome back. Today we are making some Pride cupcakes. So I know that Pride Month is almost technically over, but I mean, it's not just one month where we should be celebrating Pride, it is all the time. So I think that this video is relevant all year round. So these cupcakes are adorable and they are the Pride colors on the outside and on the inside. So when you slice or bite into them, the colors of the flags are reflected on the inside. So let's get started. Okay, so first we're gonna bake the cupcakes. We wanna beat some butter and sugar with an electric mixer until it's pale and smooth. Add some vanilla extract and eggs one at a time, mixing with each addition. And I'll have all the ingredients and everything in the quantities listed in the description box down below. In a separate bowl, combine some flour, baking soda, and salt. Add this to the batter in two additions, alternating with some sour cream. Then you want to divide the batter into as many bowls as our colors in the pride flag of your choice and then spoon them into a cupcake pan in the order of the flag. So for the gay flag, we are working in the opposite direction. So first is purple, blue, green, yellow, orange, and red. Because when we slice into it, we want to see the flag right side up. For the bisexual flag, first you want to do blue, then purple, then pink. For polysexual, blue, green, and pink. For transgender, blue, pink, white, pink, and blue. For gender queer, green, white, and purple. For demisexual, we want to do gray, and then black and purple next to each other. This is the harder flag to create. And then white on top. For asexual, purple, white, gray, and black. For pansexual, blue, yellow, and pink. And I can't decide if this is like a yellow or an orange, but something in between. For gender fluid, blue, black, purple, white, and pink. For intersexual, pink, white, pink, blue, white, and pink. For non-binary, black, purple, white, and yellow. And then lastly, for agender, you wanna use black, gray, white, green, white, gray, and black. Then pop them into the oven at 350 degrees Fahrenheit for about 15 to 20 minutes or until a skewer inserted into the centers comes out clean and cool completely. Then to make the buttercream, beat some butter with an electric mixer until it's pale and fluffy. Add the vanilla extract and confectioner sugar one cup at a time, beating with each addition. Then just like the cupcakes, divide the buttercream into as many bowls as our colors in the pride flag of your choice. And again, use food coloring to dye the buttercream. To pipe a multicolor swirl, so I'm gonna show you how we're doing it for the gay flag. You wanna place a piping bag fitted with a large piping tip into a tall glass, and then spread the different colors vertically into the piping bag to create different stripes of color. Squeeze the piping bag until you see all colors emerging from the tip. Then just pipe a swirl of buttercream onto your cupcakes and decorate it with some coordinating candies, sprinkles, and of course, some edible glitter because during Pride, we need glitter. <laughs> and you are done. So I thank you all so much for watching. I hope that you like this recipe. I actually have a line of merchandise coming out to support Pride. I wish that it came out at the beginning of this month, but as you guys know, this like, this year is just, oh my God. So 
Um, it will be coming very, very soon. I'll let you guys know. Obviously, a portion of the proceeds of um, that line will be donated. So um, I'm very, very excited to show you that line. I've had some ideas in my mind for like a year now, and they are going to be fabulous. So make sure to stay tuned on my Instagram because that is where it will be, I guess, announced first or most obviously on my Instagram feed when you scroll through it. So um, definitely check that out. If you'd like some more pride recipes, I will link my playlist in the cards right here. But anyways, I love you guys so much and I will see you on Thursday or honestly Friday because I seem to be uploading Wednesdays and Fridays now um, for a new recipe. So yeah, I'll see you guys then. Bye.